Hello everyone and welcome back to our continued let's play of Terranigma. The Goatening. The, the 69 goats. The 69 goats on the wall. Oh. I wish I had sweet with was. <laughs> you would watch this shit so much. Wait, what? If I, if I had Sweetie Pie's voice, oh yeah, everyone would watch this right now. <laughs> Probably so. I'm pretty sure that the Sweetie Pie voice actually would kind of be upset though. Yeah, possibly. I'd personally be kind of surprised. I got 99 gems. That's an odd number. I guess 100 was too much. I guess 100 was Say too much. God, this chest is OP. It needs an F. <laughs> 99. 99. Probably so. Sounds about right. Uh. So, anyways, yeah, that'd be pretty cool, though. I think, I think, and to be fair, I'm pretty sure, uh, your, your special someone would be a little surprised if you sound like Sweet Bell. I would do, I would, I would totally take that anyway. <laughs> so you're... I know if a wizard is popping for me, like, do you want your voice to be Sweet Bell? I'm like, sure. <laughs> be quite <laughs> magical. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I guess that's fair. Obviously, if someone came up and they were like, Hey, do you want your voice to be like Rainbow Dash or Scootaloo? I'd be like, fuck yeah. Even if someone came up and they were like, Hey, do you want your voice to be like Pinkie Pie? I'd be like, I'd probably annoy some people, but sure. Do you want your voice to be Twist? Nah. No one... Not even because I just like Twist, but no one likes Twist. I'd walk into like... I'd walk into like a a brony meetup and yeah, I'd be like, "Hey, everyone!" with my twist voice, and I'd be like, "Fucking yeah, die, twist!" Laugh at the awesome impression. Oh, pro no, that's a fair point. I'd be like, "Hi, guys!" And it would be like, "Die, traitor!" <laughs> I kill you anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> but now I'm just. <laughs> I'm imagining eyes of your cosplay bullshit I would have if, if, people, if, if people could make their voice be like Rainbow Dash's voice. Yeah, it's a fair point. They make cosplays, but be scary. They make cosplays pretty, pretty creepy and spot on, but you know, whatever. Like I was gonna say, uh, but yeah, I, yeah, I don't even know what I'll say about that, but I will get back to that. But I was going to say. That um they they'd be like the guards of women they I'd I'd come from twist of voice and be like hi guys then they'd be like stop criminal scum <laughs> <laughs> you're falling in love being in bad pony <laughs> yeah bad ponies don't exist if we make that happen by killing everyone who is a bad pony <laughs> that'd be pretty intense I uh, I I think I, I think I could see it as a first year like if they give a a first year as it like they have a perfect void, but they have a perfect void by Jake the Lord as being extremely extreme. You know, I okay. actually I actually kind of like that idea for a fanfic. Just, 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 just like everything perfect, but only because like, stealing something makes you get murdered. <laughs> right, exactly. It's one, it's one of those things. Man, those rocks do like nothing to these slimes, you see that? <laughs> You just sort of walk on a slime. It's a slime. What do you want? Uh, I don't know. I, I I'm stabbing a slime with a spear. It's it's effective. It's a burning one. Oh, that's true. It's a burning spear. <laughs> so Unless I'm... it's a burning rock, it's not gonna do anything. <laughs> now he need burning rocks. But yeah, I assume that they actually didn't power up the rocks over time or whatever. So I assume they just get less and less useful. Yeah, probably so. That would make that would that would make sense. Well, but I mean that would well. I'd assume that arcs throwing ar arms would get stronger, but you know rocks themselves won't get stronger. But I mean, he always has the same as well. Yeah, yeah, he has. He always has the same throne. I doubt they'll ever power that up much, if any. Oh my god, man, that thing actually looks kind of creepy. I can only see still frames of it. Oh, wow. okay, it's a yeti. Okay, it's it's a yeti. Oh, it's a yeti now. Why is why is it a yeti now? Ow, jeez. Okay, apparently. I guess it's these fists because you fucking get in an avalanche. Crap. This guy's actually pretty intense. Okay, I need to heal. Can I? How much damage? Ah, you crap! Just no, man. Actually, just killed me. Arc senses faded away. 
Well, that was kind of a pain. I just, I can't, I couldn't, okay, I'll have to heal before I enter the battle, because apparently I all of a sudden can't enter my inventory, uh, during the battle, which is really annoying, so I'll be right back, everybody. Everyone, and we are back, and this time I'm more prepared to fight the boss that turns into a yeti for some how reason. <laughs> You're kind of interesting, and then he changes into yeti. Yeah. He, he actually looks interesting, he's like, I guess I'll be a yeti now. I, like, I dislike this attack though, I have to say. I can't see him. Oh. Darn it. It, <sighs> it, it, it actually falls the moment you saw the boss, which means I can look at the awesome looking boss. That's, that's... It looks like a human. It looks like some kind of interesting human -y thing. So what do you have to do? I can see it now. Well, okay. You hit him? Apparently, it doesn't seem like it, but apparently the easiest thing to do on this boss is get stuck on the, um, side of the wall. I think, can you pick up those things? No. Ow. Which is actually what got, part of what got me killed initially, because I thought, oh, maybe I'm supposed to pick these up, but no, you're not supposed to. Can you spin jumper to hit him? No, I can't seem to hit him at all while, he, while he's up there. Go ahead and eat really it and all, magic, and all the healing items. Can you get down here so I can smack you, or what do I... Now, oh, okay. Now you're one of these guys? And why did, why did it, like, teleport me? And why are you, like, flipping out everywhere? Like, look, <laughs> look at that movement pattern. Oh, wait, do I... I don't know, I think fight ever too much. <laughs> Guess it's like a stay frame fight, it's very fascinating. <laughs> Uh, sorry that it's the like... Picture version of it. Yeah, sorry that, like, the screen share is being bad. I don't know what's up with that. But yeah, basic... No, that's a F, but he's just flipping out. <laughs> yeah, he's just flipping out. I'm shooting his things back at him for some reason. I think that I would call them moons. Moons? Yeah, they're moons. I don't know why, but he's basically shooting moons at me. Hey, I critical shot it back at him somehow. What, what, what are you? Jeez, what is with this guy? <laughs> I don't even that didn't even make sense in the name of physics, but sure, I'll take it. I see you now. Yeah. Clearly, clearly. What the fuck is this? <laughs> see what I mean? He's just flipping out. <laughs> hey, I beat him. Powerful. I'm leveled he up. Should have stayed a yeti. <laughs> he should have just stayed a freaking yeti. That was not very hard. Uh, is there any more? Or is he dead? Is that it? But you leveled up. I leveled up. So, wow. That, oh, but see, no, that, that is it. That is. See, there's another form. So, I don't even know. So it just mid fight, he's like, "What the fuck are you doing?" <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Up. Yeah, I don't know how I gained a level off of that, but all right. So, bats are a thing, I guess. He turns into bats. Yeah, he's not gonna turn into flutter, bud. <laughs> flutter bat, yeah. Then, I, they never did go anywhere with that whole flutter bat thing, did they? Yeah, I didn't. Well, I guess it was just a... Yeah, I, I, I assume they never would, actually. What yeah, I, I, I assume... Said that. Yeah, I assume... You're right. I assume that it was just kind of a, um, like, oh, horror movie. Reference. Yeah, exactly. Because every horror movie ever is like, Oh, you think it's over, but it's not really because we want to spooky and make more horror movies because we're stupid. Because like, <laughs> we want sequels. Yeah. I mean, I did a lot of those because I also did one with a um, book, with a castle episode. Oh yeah, it's the, yeah, I remember that. I'm kind of taking damage from jumping into him, but obviously it's the most damaging thing I have, so whatever. And honestly, this is his least deadly form so far. Well, actually, no, actually no, it's, it's hitting you more often. It's hitting, okay, it's not as undeadly as his loon, moon form, but it's not nearly as, like, he did twice the amount of damage he's doing now in his yeti form. This honestly isn't very scary. He's hitting me, but it's minimal damage. It's not very effective. <laughs> it's not very effective. Uh, bats. Bats are not very effective. 
I'm put not putting them on the picture. back of the box. Maybe I'd put the goat eating the other goat in the back of the box. I'm sure that's the perfect, perfect thing to put on the back of a box. At least it wouldn't freaking scare children to death because <laughs> they just didn't expect it. <laughs> yeah, that's we a good point. Should, someone should have sued these guys. <laughs> someone, are you saying someone did or someone should have? Someone should have. <laughs> Why would someone should have sued these guys? You should have just got someone for life. <laughs> I don't know. I, I, maybe, maybe it scarred someone for life. Why is that goat eating Azagot's balls? <laughs> uh, okay, this battle. Kids, why do you know what boys are? <laughs> uh, I'm gonna eat this other healing thing, ow. And then this boss yeah, fight's actually getting eat. kind of annoying. The boobs you're eating are actually secretly good boys. <laughs> they probably are. That would explain everything except not really anything. But it'd be Maybe pretty, it'd be it. pretty metal though. Okay, seriously, like, how come? Why? I, I this fight's really obnoxious, actually. It's I, because you insulted them. Maybe it's because I insulted this guy. But jeez, there's no way to kill the bats. Well, okay. They always hit you. I it's do. It's an endurance sense of endurance test of the destiny. It's a pretty endurance testy. Oh, damn it. Like, I don't even know if I'm doing it right. I'm doing damage to the guy, but these bats keep happening, and honestly, they're kind of obnoxious to dodge because there's so many of them. Oh, I, can, I can, actually can slide through them. Okay. Steven, what do you have? I actually don't know if you're doing damage to him or not. I don't know either, because, like. If you're not, then this is fascinating to watch. <laughs> Uh Okay, oh. and there it goes. I guess I was doing the right thing. He exploded like to... everything in the universe. Yeah, like everything. Defeated Dark Morph. Ark. Or were you the voice? Go ahead. The day has oh, yeah. come for the res re recreation of humans. Resurrection. Resurrection. Oh resurrection, I'm sorry. That uh, texting gets me every freaking time. <laughs> it is come for the time of Gazor and Rection of humans. <laughs> the erection of humans. <laughs> Indeed. Humans are wonderful animals with the ability to create technology. You don't have to tell me the human is bitch. What do you think I am? Fuck you. I, I don't know. You're a good eating bitch. <laughs> humans are wonderful animals and they eat all of you good buddies. Let's, yeah, let's create all of the humans, and then we can go and and eat 69 goats on the wall. <laughs> yes, we can go down there and like, kill that goat. Yep, and take that goat and eat it! But they have no idea how the vast power they get, really? <laughs> humans do. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Ark, you must keep leading the growth of the world. I think we're good. We have made, you, we have made everything of value. We can stop now. We we made plants. We made animals. We made birds, for, which aren't yeah. animals for some reason. We hate humans. Have we made wind? Oh don't no, no, What's I don't even know what's going on. Have we made? Yeah, we made wind. That's true. That was a really short item. <laughs> yeah, that we just went up and we're like, "Hey, guy, wake the four companies." Like, oh okay. Oh my god, it's a dancing flower. Yeah. And it's not Yod. <laughs> it's a it's an ox guy. And he's eating it. Oh no. Oh no, no, oh no. <laughs> they're eating it. And then they're gonna eat the other plant. <laughs> and I don't that be... terrifying for a plant to watch. Yeah, it must be pretty terrifying actually. I mean, is the bird gonna oh, yeah, eat the, the... Gonna the... Eat the... <laughs> Wow, that was some pretty intense eating. Did you see it? Just I don't know if he was supposed to be eating the ox or not. <laughs> I don't know. I just went up to that ox and BAM! The ox is gone. Oh. Why just a laser eye? Did. Jeez. That monster just freaking what? owned the bird. Those poor birds, they didn't even see it coming. I didn't even see it coming. <laughs> I don't even know what's going on. Uh, and then, and then I just show up and stab it. <laughs> okay. Like, thanks. Uh, are we high? Thanks, Obama. I mean, we are Japanese, but are we high on top of being Japanese? <laughs> We're quite possibly. 
Oh, oh okay, Ark. And then Des found <laughs> then... you. I guess. Aww. I, I would have loved if the goat came in and kicked your ass. <laughs> It's like intense. I hate my husband. Now I have superpowers. Yeah, but no. Apparently... Husband gives me super strings. <laughs> apparently, it's just Arc falls over. And he's like, I'm done now. I'm gonna die. And the game had like some sad music for some reason. Oh, chapter three: oh, Resurrection okay. of the Genius. Or is it Gen Gen Genus? Genus? I don't know. I don't know. That's it. Of the, of the Kabal Kabalaba. That's <laughs> what I just call them when I can't read something. <laughs> this is, makes sense, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna say it's probably the genius. Oh, hi. Oh, hi, woman. You wanna join me? Yeah, we're going to eyes are look Actually, don't, don't join me. Look at her face. <laughs> look at her eye. Yeah, her face it's is... Kinda, like halfway on her face. <laughs> her face looks a little weird. Uh... The eyes where her ear should be. Yeah, her her eyes like actually you can see her ear just behind her eye. But that's where the is the eyes should be the ear. Yeah, it, it should be. Oh, let's see. Do you want to be this bitch? Yes, you're awake. How do you feel? I have a giant boner. You want to hang? <laughs> I I have to go to tell Lord Kumari. Man, that would be pretty awkward, wouldn't wouldn't it be? You wake up and you're just saved <laughs> like morning wood, and they're like, "Hey, do you want to get out?" And you're like, "Ah, oh, just just give me a few minutes." <laughs> <laughs> just this heavy idea, woman. Yeah. Wait, don't try to move yet. Let's uh, see. It's, uh, it's not my fault. <laughs> it's moving on its own. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> that's the most hur like slow hurrying ever. Is it really that not important to go tell your lord? I'm I'm not ready to move yet. Shut up, woman. <laughs> Shut up, woman. Look, I bet I'll check my stats screen and bam, yeah, I'm fine. 154 health. I'm kind of worried that's, about me. That's a lot of HP. You can get impaired like 800 times. Yeah, I can. Feel fine already? You were in a deep sleep for three years. What? What? <laughs> what? Um, I grew so. I I feel I feel tro like, like whoever is making you do all this shit. I be like, fuck you! I'm, I'm done. I'm quitting. You fucking asshole. So that's what the freaking fever dream was about. <laughs> of her. Daddy well, does that explain? It doesn't explain anything, but I mean, apparently we had some freaky ass, like, <laughs> some freaky, uh, whatever, fever dream while we were asleep for three years. Because, I mean, it's being asleep for three years, that's how it works, right? You can just do that. Which I think if you sleep for three years, you're probably dead. Probably so. Don't exert yourself, eat well, and build your strength. How exactly do you guys keep me fed? You don't yeah. look like you have technology for this shit. Yeah, I was gonna say, like these days. You don't uh, even. In the last three years, you didn't even decide to put a table beside my fucking bed. <laughs> Seriously. Uh, like in these days, the, I can't imagine they had any means to things like feed me and stuff, like in, in the days this game takes place. And, you know, obviously these days people can do stuff, but I don't know. Or homes in stone cliffs to avoid harsh winds and snow. Um, okay. <laughs> oh no, you trapped me. Oh. What a joke. I wish I could see this. Oh, it's, I'm, I'm gonna. It's okay. I, I'm just watching your black screen. Oh. It actually it did the screen force exactly on when on the transition between yours between when you left the house or whatever. Mm -hmm. So it's just black. That's, Perfectly black. That's weird. Pretty damn racist. Yaks are important. It carries things like milk and meat. And its dung can be burned as fuel. Nothing goes to waste. Oh. They, they, see? That, that's where the fucking... They, they learn from that goat. Yep. Well, I mean, to be fair, people's gotta eat. They're gonna eat the plants and the, the yaks, and they're eating both. So, I was gonna say one thing. What was it? Yeah, do you think they would think you're crazy if after waking up after three years you're like, I created all of these <laughs> objects, including you? I'm not, I'm not sure. That's a good question. I created a vent. Admittedly, 
Admittedly, everything else is pretty automatically accepting, so maybe maybe the humans will be too. Like, for humans it does sound crazy, but these are kind of prehistoric peoples. Maybe they'd just be like, yeah, you know, we kind of just were resurrected after being asleep for forever. You know, thank you, guy. I guess he didn't wait three years till he showed up to them. Yeah. <laughs> you already seen Lord Kumari? He was very concerned about you. Lord Kumari has a wonderful power. The power to suck my dick. So after three years, <laughs> I can what he use did for three years. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe I wouldn't need it then. <laughs> yeah, that but, means that we actually know that he mentioned the whole world, wondering what Nick is even was when it's three years in the making. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, when I grow up, I'm becoming a monk to protect Lord Kumari. I told you about that, monkey. Ah, <laughs> oh, so you can see again. Oops, I totally yes. didn't break that thing. Why don't you be this guy? Oh, it's fu it's you. You're finally awake. Pleasant dreams. Uh. Right, yes, I would. Pleasant dreams, I was asleep for three years, you fucking cunt. <laughs> Ah, yeah, I. It, it's, if someone ever asked me that, I might be like, bitch, bitch, lab. Yeah, I imagine, like, if you were in a freaking coma for like three years and then you woke up and someone was like, hey, had some sweet dreams, you'd be like, you, you just slap them. Yeah. Uh, hey, oh my god, it's Buddhists. Oh my god. We you slept, slept a long time in a dump. Yeah. Uh, you, can, you can go. Go ahead. We slept a long time in darkness and re-emerged in this world. What has happened came about because of something in the past. Everything that was rooted in events from previous lives. All that people do and have done will shape the future. Past shapes the present and the present shapes the future. Okay. These guys are extremely not wise. It's like, <laughs> everything that is, is because of things that have been done in the past. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> hey, Grimmy, if I shoot you, you're gonna die in the present. <laughs> wow, that's really physiological, Sapir. If I, if I eat a donut, that means that I'll, that I'll have eaten a donut, and in the future be less hungry. It does mean that you would be a donut heavier, and the donut will no longer be eatable. <laughs> yeah. I'd be surprised if it was. <laughs> All living things eventually lose their physical forms, so and we live praying for happiness in our future lives. That is not much wisdom, saying you just said everyone's gonna die at some point. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> uh, and that's why we yeah. pray, because we don't wanna we don't wanna end up as something dumb like this snowman that I'm gonna kill. Bam! Die. They used to talk to you. Huh? Your universe snowman talked to you, remember? Oh yeah, they do. Oh, well, it was... No, wait, it wasn't a soul remember, it was a... Um, Pumpkins. Ant. Yeah. Bah. Is that what Yak's saying? Do they say that? I don't know, I don't know. Oh. Do you think Asian guys get that correct? I don't <laughs> even know what an ox is. Probably not. Welcome, what can I help you with? Can we at least find some of these magic cog people again? Magic what? Oh yeah, those guys. Uh, probably just let me buy some healing stuff real quick. Guess I'd like some bowls. I don't see no sense of starting game. The oh, Did an they... actual shop, yeah. Give me, give me just literally all the bulbs. That, I find them pleasant. Nine years later, I mean three years later, you can wake up and your money. Isn't still there. Yeah, I know. So I'll be like, you know, this guy's fucking rich. Just whoop. <laughs> I'd assume so. I'd assume this head guy would've been a douchebag and would be like, yo, I'm just gonna steal this dead guy's money. No one, no one's, no one's going to be suspicious when I buy all the things all of a sudden. I'm, I'm the. I'm the king just after. totally tanked the economy. Yeah. Deflects curses worn by monks. Okay. Okay. Well, that's nice. I'm getting to what the end of the game, though. Yeah, I, I think you're right. We've gotten most of the armor. And... Well, actually, wait, you don't still only have one of the four main things. That is, that is true, and I actually have none of them for the uh, weapons. But I, don't, I just cannot believe this game goes on that much longer. 
It, it's a little hard to believe. The game seems like it'd be ending around now, but to be fair, we haven't even encountered a real, like, big villain. But it just won't be known. Yeah, there might not even be. the whole apocalypse was its villain in its own. Well, that's been the case so far, but I, like, this game doesn't seem like the kind of game that would just end it there. Like, I can't believe this game would have some kind hey, of I, I, massive the goat is villain. The main villain. The goat's probably gonna be the main villain. Goat, goat man. Oh, hi, are you the king guy? You find. Oh, do you wanna be him? You have. Okay. You. I can't fucking voice him. I don't know. I only have two voices. What uh, do you want? Just, I don't know. Just sound kingly. Try and sound like a badass. You finally awoke, Ark. I'm Kumari. Until you get better, you should rest at Laza. It is safe here. You will discover what you must do in due time. You can no longer converse with plants and animals. What? Like Boo! I should have resurrected you fuckers. I loved talking to plants and animals. Fuck you. You, you kept inserting them whenever you did. I know, but now, <laughs> now, I, now I have humans to insult, and that's worse. I want to go back to insulting goats. Goats are stupid. Today, that goat, that goat is always gonna remember you. <laughs> you are your delicious boy. It's probably dead by now. Three years later, isn't it? They're like, you think he's gonna come back and save me? <laughs> yeah, for sure. Uh, probably. But you never could save him because he could not in contact. Yeah. Take this with you. Entire danger. Use it to summon me. Now I just wanna like see him kickbox enemy. <laughs> yeah, seriously. I gotta try his bone pin sometime, see what something this guy does. That's sounds kinda sexual. <laughs> it does actually. <laughs> I gotta try his bone pin sometimes. <laughs> oh yeah. Lord Kumari, Master Maiho has arrived. You guys have a lot for title version. Yeah. Like, yes, I know. Please tell him to come. <laughs> <Even now. laughs> I don't even know if Buddhist head my lords and masters. That's actually what I was thinking. I'm like, I don't quite know what they're going for here. Did they think that American audiences wouldn't get their religious stuff? Because, I mean, maybe we wouldn't. But to be fair, this really doesn't seem like a culture... Like, like, this guy doesn't look like he'd be a king. It's because they are more like monks than anything. Right, exactly. They, they, and they're they, Buddhist monks. Yeah, they're Buddhist monks. I don't see why... They're like, not European medieval. Yeah, it's all... I, I'm not quite sure what his title would be, but I'm pretty sure it's clear this isn't a monarchy. <laughs> At least certainly doesn't feel like a monarchy, well, at least not European lordship. style. Yeah, lordship. Ark. Oh, I'm sorry. There's always a purpose to what occurs in life. Like that goat that ate his buddy. <laughs> yeah. There was totally a reason for that. Probably was They're a just trying to figure out what. <laughs> the presents will inevitably be tied to whatever will happen here. Okay. You know, actually, now if you think about it, it's pretty sad. He ate his husband and still died of starvation. Yeah, that is pretty sad. If that's probably his dying moment, probably. he cried himself to sleep, Pro being like, it was for nothing. Uh. <laughs> probably so, jeez. You make this even more sad. The game kind of forgot about it and suppose, like, it could be, it could be pretty sad. Oh, I like man. the way that you just, like, don't give a fuck. It's like, hey, you're supposed to... Nah, never mind. <laughs> Wait, was I supposed to do something? I thought oh, I was... I thought you were supposed to do something. I don't know, probably so, considering that nothing exactly happened while I was asleep. Didn't he tell you to go do something? Uh, I don't know, hey dudes, or if there's always a purpose to presence one, I'm like... I'm pretty sure he told you to do something. Oh. Wait, what'd you just say to me? Uda Kumari stated this. You belong to nothing, and therefore you are important. Oh, okay. <laughs> you are nothing. You're not important. <laughs> I, 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 I read something about about Lord Kumari saying something, then he said something about nothing. And I was like, wait a minute. 
<laughs> you suck stick in my eyes, you're unemployed. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Lord Kamari is a living god. He will be reborn after his death. Through, through many bodies, he has witnessed the world's growth. All the... It's been three years. <laughs> I was gonna say, to be fair, it's been three years since you guys have been revived. How many times do you guys die? <laughs> yeah, did you stop, like, eating fucking the... the... Poison the stuff on the floor. Seriously. Maybe he's not British. He's just used to know what bread is like numb. He probably is. I mean, to be fair, you guys have only been alive three years, but I hope you guys know to not, like, go out and jump into, like, the mouths of everything. Not like, not like your guy. Yeah. See, it's actually, the eating that paint is brilliant, because no one would think to poison the lead paint. <laughs> Indeed. Said she can freely create and control mirages. Okay, so I guess we should go talk to her probably. Hey you. You wanna end the pot, by the way? Oh yeah, you're right. Who has been too many places and tells us neat stories? But yeah, we we can figure out what to do next time. Thank you all for watching, and we'll see you all next time. An arc in the return of the human race. Yay. Yeah. Actually, no, just the Buddhist part of the human race. Yeah, this is the dumb Buddhist part. See you guys.